signals, and this makes hormones really, really, really important. Hormones are command molecules, signaling molecules. It's actually four different types of hormones. The most well-known is the ones we talk about all the time. Those are called endocrine hormones, but there's other kinds of hormones too. And we will continue this very important discussion on hormone health and how it relates to degenerative disease and how it relates to nutrition and nutritional strategies on our next Bright Side episode. So you're going to want to tune into that. That'll be tomorrow on the Bright Side. Time to hit our phones at 855-660-4261. We do have a couple lines open for you. If you haven't been able to get on board previously, now's the time to give us, give us a shot. 855-660-4261. Let us help you change your life and let us help you change others' lives as well with good nutritional information. 855-660-4261 is our number. Let's go off to Iowa and welcome James to the Bright Side. What's up, James? How you doing, buddy? Hey, Ben. Thanks for taking my call. Sure. What's going on today? Yeah, man, I discovered your site like a week ago, and I just, I got to say, I wish I would have discovered it a couple years ago. Nice. Uh, How'd you, did you stumble onto it? How did you find it? Uh, yeah, I just actually, actually, I was just looking at some of, uh, I just typed in a couple of things I was looking for, and your website popped up, so the nice. longevity stuff, and... Um, Good deal. Yeah, huh? I, uh, what's that? How, how can I help you? What's going on today? Yeah, I have uh, been dealing with acne and extremely dry skin. You know, I'm 26, so I've been dealing with it for a while. Okay. And uh, I'm wondering if there's anything I can do for that. Oh, I heck have yes. Heck yes. Redness, you know. Heck it's yes. The whole shebang. We're going to so change your life, then. James. We're going to change your uh, life. You want? We can get your skin to do a 180 degree turn and to begin to improve tomorrow once you start doing a couple of things. First of all, I don't, want, I don't want to get into, uh, I don't want to do the whole seven different types of acne thing, but if you Google seven or you go on to benfuchsarchives.com, you'll find a search engine. And if you uh, punch in acne, you'll get all kinds of, uh, all kinds of stuff that we've done, all kinds of shows that we've done and talks, that, uh, all kinds of information about how to deal with acne. There's different types of acne, but for the most part, if you have redness associated with your acne, you're dealing with some kind of defensive response. And this is a hallmark idea of the bright side. This is one of the major principles that we talk about. Disease, or much of what we call disease, is the manifestation of an, an emergency response or a defensive response. Same with acne. So the most likely uh, assault on the body, the most likely entrance of, uh, of offending agents that will spark up a defensive response is food. So the first thing you want to do is notice when your acne flares up, uh, if you have, uh, associate those flare-ups with specific foods. It might be helpful for you to do a food diary where you write down everything you eat and then write down how your skin appears or anything that happens to your skin uh, in response to those foods. And you can also do it with digestive symptoms where you eat a food and then notice digestive symptoms and write those down. And over the course of a week or two weeks or three weeks, you're gonna to start to accumulate data that links foods with specific flare-ups or specific digestive issues. Now, if you know you have digestive issues or food intolerances or food allergies, you're ahead of the game. But even if you don't know it, you can start this uh, this uh, accumulation of data process almost immediately. Second thing you want to start to do is make sure you're getting uh, some skin friendly nutrients into the system and there's a bunch of them. In fact some of these will turn acne around almost immediately. This is not to marginalize or not to diminish the importance of food. So I'm going to tell you some supplements and some really good supplements for dealing with the skin but please recognize the link between food and digestive flare-ups, or uh, skin flare-ups, I'm sorry, between digestive issues. I have a, sorry, I have a question. Uh, uh, let, me, let me just finish this real quick. Okay, well, okay yeah. go ahead. What, what was your question? Well, I was just going to say, is redness and zits, is that the same thing, or is that yes. different no, no. components? It could be. It could be the same thing, absolutely. Now, it may be different components, but the first thing is you want to assume that it's the, it, they're connected. Redness always means an alert, uh, some kind of immune response, d a defensive response. And the acne, and without seeing the zits, I can't tell you. Where are they located, by the way, on your face? Uh, I've got some on my forehead, uh, some on my back and chest. Okay. And then okay. I have you know, the redness is on my cheeks and under okay. my eyes. <laughs> That's, that is almost certainly a digestive health issue, almost 100%. I, I have to see it to be sure, and you'll have to test it out to be sure, but almost 100% that you're dealing with a digestive issue. Probably it has to do with fat absorption. That's what the dry skin is. So here's what you're going to need to do. Number one, as I say, link your flare-ups to specific foods and then eliminate those foods. Number two, focus on fatty nutrients and the absorption of fats. Now, absorption of fats means whenever you eat a fatty food, make sure you're using 
using your ultimate enzymes from Longevity. You can you can get those on brightsideben.com or you can call 866-735-2470. Tell them you want the ultimate enzymes. Take them after your meals, three or four after your meals, and then do a little swig of apple cider vinegar with them. And then in addition, with the ultimate enzymes and with your meals, you're going to want to start to take in some fatty nutrients. Vitamin A is especially important for skin, as uh, for acne, as well as for dry skin. So you may be dealing with something as mild as as uh, as easy to, to resolve as vitamin A deficiency. Now, if you're not absorbing vitamin A, you're going to have to deal with all the digestive stuff, but get yourself on 20,000 international units of vitamin A. You want to do that right away. You also want to get on 50 milligrams of zinc picolinate a day, and again, you want to do that right away. Do those today. 20,000 IU of vitamin A, 50 milligrams of zinc picolinate every day. Get yourself on the OPC or the Ultimate Selenium from Longevity. So when you call 866-735-2470 and you ask about the uh, uh, the uh, Ultimate Enzymes, make sure you uh, also ask them about the Ultimate Selenium product. And then if you want to throw in a couple other things, we'll make sure you're taking the Healthy Start Pack. That goes without saying. And if you want to throw a couple other things in there, get on the BioLumen Nightly Essence and the Fucoidin Z. You should notice results almost right away. I'm talking about a reduction in the redness, especially once you link your, uh, your, your, digest, your uh, skin symptoms to foods, you should notice uh, improvement in the redness almost immediately, and over the course of time, you're gonna notice improvement on the back and on the neck, as well as on the face. If you wanna add one or two more things, get on something called NAC, which stands for NAC, or an N-acetylcysteine. Uh, and you want about 200 to 400 milligrams of that a day, and then also 400 international units a day of vitamin E, and perhaps uh, maybe 1,000 to 2,000 milligrams a day of vitamin B5. But make sure you're taking it with your Healthy Star Pack and with your Beyond Tangy Tangerine. And James, as I say, you should notice results pretty darn quickly. Within one or two days, you should notice improvement, and you should notice complete resolution of your acne within less than a month, or less than two months, I'll say. Uh, hang tight, James. We'll let you finish up when we come back from our break. If you're on hold, don't go away. We'll get to all our callers. We'll try to get to all our callers when we come back. I'm Pharmacist Ben. You're listening to The Bright Side. Pharmacist Ben Fuchs has learned the importance of good fats for good health. Good fats are essential fatty acids, and they're called essential because they're necessary for good health. That's why he uses Ultimate EFAs from Longevity. Among the fats, the most powerful are two fats that are referred to as essential fatty acids. Now, nothing in the world of nutrition is more important than essential fatty fatty acids. The word essential means you better get it in your diet or you're in big trouble. Essential fatty acids are perhaps the most multifunctional and versatile of all the essential nutrients. Essential fatty acids are not just important for the heart. They're important for everything in the body. To get the essential fatty acids that are so important to your body, order Ultimate EFAs from Longevity by calling 866-735-2470. That's 866-735-2470. Or on the web at brightsidebin.com. That's brightsidebin.com. Order today. So we decided to upgrade the look of our home. You know, improve the curve appeal. We decided to add the look of stone to the exterior. We really like the stacked stone look. Yeah, but when I checked into the price, it was ridiculous. No way could we afford it. Then a friend told me about Genstone. G-E-N-S-T-O-N-E. Genstone comes in lightweight panels made of polyurethane. They've actually engineered the hassle out of installation. No mortar, no mesh. It was easy. Even I could do it. We just screwed the panel to the wall and it looks like stone. I mean, it really looks like stone. Yeah, from the box to the wall in minutes. We love the look of our home now. And Genstone is durable, comes with a 25-year warranty, and offers additional R-value for insulation. If you want the look of stone at a price you can afford, call Genstone at 855-955-STONE. Trust me, you'll save money. And you'll love the look. 855-955-STONE. That's 855-955-STONE. Genesis is defined as an origin, creation, or the beginning. Genesis Communications Network began with the mission of providing you with the kind of compelling content you're listening to now. And at GCNlive.com, you'll find a free archive of our nation's history, narrated by GCN hosts. Explore, share, and pass down to future generations. GCN is the future of talk radio, but we should always strive to learn from our past. Together, we are GCNlive.com. GCN. Good people need help. The Homeowners Association said we had weeds and fined us $25. We told them they had the wrong house. They said if we didn't pay it, they'd file a lien. Our attorney demanded photographs, witnesses, 
and told them if they couldn't provide this, they must cease and desist. Issue solved. Worry less and live more with LSProtection.com. That's LSProtection.com or call 855-340-SAVE. That's 855-340-7283. Results will vary from case to case. At 30dayfoodsupply.com, you can now purchase a -a one-of-a-kind product not available anywhere else. A meatless burger dry mix in four delicious flavors. With our new Oregon Trail Foods vegan burgers, all you do is add water and fry. They need no refrigeration. They're packaged in Mylar bags with an oxygen absorber for a long shelf life. They're non-GMO. They're gluten, soy, nut, and chemical-free, but they're loaded with flavor. And a good source of carbs and protein, yet low in sodium. Flavors include Italian, spicy Mexican, Chicken, six vegetable and black bean olive. Go to 30dayfoodsupply.com or call 541-229-0010 and order today. Eat them every day, take them camping, or save them for an emergency. Check them out at 30dayfoodsupply.com and click on the vegan burger icon. That's 30dayfoodsupply.com where all of our products are produced in Oregon by Oregon Trail Foods. 30dayfoodsupply.com. Headlines, suspensions, FCC investigations. That's Man Cow for you. Hear him here. GCN. All right, we're back on the bright side. Finishing up here with James in Iowa. James, buddy? Yep. Hello? Here. All right, so a couple of things real quickly. Uh, by the time you get acne on the back and on the... Uh, on the shoulders and on the back, all the way down to the butt. Sometimes we'll get it, people get it on their butt cheeks. Uh, you're dealing with a problem uh, that has been percolating for many years, and you're only 26, so I would venture to say you've probably been breaking out m- since you were a teenager, at least probably since you were a young teenager. 13, and, uh, yeah. Uh, yeah, that's, that's usually what that means, and it usually means it hasn't been controlled or resolved. Uh, the good news is, is once you start to take your digestive, uh, once you start to associate your breakouts with uh, digestive issues, take your digestive health in, uh, uh, under, or get control of your digestive health, you'll notice that your skin is going to also improve. And once you get on the supplements, it'll improve pretty darn quickly, especially the zinc and the vitamin A. But don't forget about the NAC and the vitamin E and the vitamin B5 as well and the selenium. And, of course, the healthy star pack is always important just to get you the basics. Good news is, is you can turn this thing around really quickly. Skin cells... The skin tissue turns over every four to eight weeks. That means within one really? to two months, you have a whole new setup, a whole new skin setup, and that means whatever your skin health issue is today, four to eight weeks from now, you don't have to have it, and that is really good news. Well, uh, what else do you have for me, James? Anything? Um, yeah. Well, I just have- James. James. Lost James. Okay, I'm sorry about that, James. Uh, call back, and we'll see if we can get you up here. Uh, I'm going to go real fast, you guys, because i got a whole bunch of folks who want to get on the line. Carl, the Truth Raider, real quick, welcome to the Bright Side, my man. Good morning, Pharmacist Ben. Thank you so much for coming up and, and talking to the to the group here in Portland, Oregon. I appreciate it was that. A life, Thank you. Yeah, it was a life-changing event. Oh, good. Invite me back up. I shall do. We're thinking about maybe having you come here in January. Well, maybe we'll have a little bigger venue. We'll have several hundred people to come that you can come talk to. That would be awesome. Thank you so much for setting that up, Carl. Any questions or anything today? You bet. No, we'll just uh, just a little bit. I'll touch on that a little bit. It was like, you know, it's like having your favorite rock group, <laughs> like a very famous rock group, coming and jamming in your own backyard. Are you That's saying I'm a far- like this. Am I a pharmacist rock star? Yeah, you certainly are. You're a celebrity to me and to many others out there, and God bless you, and thank you so much for that. Thank you. Um, you You're very welcome. What I wanted to talk about today is the importance, after you get a good rainstorm, I find that a lot of people don't don't do, after a good rainstorm, if the weather's not too cold, if it's comfortable enough for you, go out and take a good walk and take some deep breathing exercises. That's great. Negative ions. Nourishing. Negative yes. ions. That's what that's what rain and lightning does for us. It puts electrical energy in the air, negatively charged ions, and uh, a le- high, highly charged electrical energy, and it's really good stuff to breathe. That's that really wonderful smell that's in the air after it rains. I'm going to move on, Carl. Uh, I'm going to take some more calls. Okay, buddy? Thanks for your call. Okay. Thanks, thanks for your kind words. I appreciate it, too. All right. Uh, let's see. Charlena in Texas. What's cooking? Welcome to the Bright Side, my dear. Hi, Ben. Thank you for taking my call. Uh, sure. My name is pronounced Shalina. Shalina. Um, Yes, sir. Um, I have been diagnosed with breast cancer in my right breast. Um, okay. I'm 32 years old. Oh, my gosh. 
And, uh, yeah, it's a shocker. Um, I was, you know, drinking excessively for a while, but had a pretty healthy diet. And upon hearing this news, have turned around my diet to, um, I'm eating.